This is Casey Kasem bringing you the top 40 hits in the United States. Coming up is the hit single that pays off a casual promise that Robin Gibb made to a rhythm and blues singer he bumped into 10 years ago. And it gave that singer his first American hit in 13 years. Debuting in the countdown this week is a man whose last top 40 record came 13 years ago. Jimmy Ruffin was hitting in the mid-60s with songs like i Passed This Way Before and What Becomes of the Broken Hearted. His latest is Hold On to My Love. AT40 originates in Hollywood. You know, for a small town, Meridian, Mississippi has produced more than its share of chart acts. Back in the 50s, there was Jimmy Rogers with hits like Honeycomb and Kisses Sweeter Than Wine. More recently, there was Steve Forbert, who hit with Romeo's tune. And this week, another of Meridian's native sons is back in the countdown. At number 20, Jimmy Ruffin with Hold On to My Love. Today, American Top 40. I'm Casey Kasem. The Ruffin brothers, David and Jimmy, have made quite a mark for themselves in the record business. David was lead singer for The Temptations before going solo, and Jimmy Ruffin has had four top 40 hits. His latest, up to number 14 this week. Here's Jimmy Ruffin and Hold On to My Love. American Top 40. Well, now we're up to the song that pays off a casual promise made 10 years ago in a London hotel lobby. It was less a promise than one of those polite exchanges that people make and usually forget about. But this one wasn't forgotten. The conversation took place 10 years ago between soul singer Jimmy Ruffin and B.G. Robin Gibb. Jimmy Ruffin told us the story. In 1970, after several hits on both the soul and the pop charts here in the U.S., he'd moved to England to see what he could do on the British charts. Well, on his way to a party in a London hotel, he was introduced in the lobby to Robin Gibb. And Jimmy said that instantly he and Robin struck a very strong rapport. They stood there and chatted for a few minutes, and Robin said, Let's get together someday and write some songs. And Jimmy said, Sounds like a good idea. Then they said goodnight and went their separate ways. And their paths never crossed again, until ten years later. That was just a few months ago when Robin Gibb decided to try his hand as a solo producer. Jimmy told us that Robin called and said he'd be glad to produce some songs with Ruffin if Jimmy was still up to it after 10 years. And Jimmy said, you got a deal. And the result of that collaboration is up to number 12 in our countdown in American Top 40, co-written and co-produced by Robin Gibb, who remembered. This is Jimmy Ruffin's first Top 40 hit in 13 years. Today. As we continue the countdown of the 40 biggest hits in the USA, I'd like to welcome WTJS in Jackson, Tennessee to the American Top 40 family. Great to have you with us. My name's Casey Kasem, and we're doing our weekly survey of the most popular records in the country as computed by Billboard magazine. And on we go. Singer Jimmy Ruffin has had four top 40 singles in his 14-year chart career. What Becomes of the Broken Hearted in 1966, I've Passed This Way Before and Gonna Give Her All the Love I've Got in 67, and currently the number 10 song in America, Hold On to My Love. The hits from coast to coast.